The Follow Line project is one of the biggest infrastructure projects in the Scandinavian countries. This is the construction of the longest rail wheel tunnel in Norway. Most of Oslo citizens are not aware that uh, we are doing such a big project here in this area. Oslo is a good place to live. We have the fjord on one side and the city is uh, on the other side, surrounded by the forest. 600,000 people are living within the borders of Oslo. It is expected that the area south of Oslo will have an increase of the population of approximately 30%. And that's where the Follow Line project comes in. This tunnel is going to connect the cities of Xi and Oslo with a high-speed train. For many years, tunneling in Norway has only been done with the drill and blast methods, but TBMs are very much capable to uh, cut this rock. We are doing the excavation by the use of four tunnel boring machines operating from one central located access point. When you start TBM boring here, you continuously have to drive through a hard rock. You need the right machine, the right tools, and the right team to uh, go through it. I've never seen a rock like this. It's one of the hardest rocks in the world. It's very hard. Yes, it is. We have a, a high traffic of cutters every week. Normally we are changing uh, approximately from 10 to 15 cutters a day. It's a tough job, absolutely. There's no doubt about that. You can have the number of 24,000 cutter This changes. The value of this is even higher than the value of a real TVM. The infrastructure available here in the construction site is not enough. We send the used cutters to Germany for refurbishment to guarantee the quality of the process. We have procured very special MSV vehicles from the French company TMS, which is also part of the Handknecht Group, to transport two complete rings at a time. Hernik is always a partner. When they come to the table, they come with solutions. Experience is massive. Herrenknecht is the only TBM supplier that has a proven track record for such a project's goal. We fight every day against this rock, but at the end of the day, we win. When this machine is capable of doing the job in the hardest rock in the world, it will be capable of doing any job in the world. TBM is a realistic alternative for the excavation of tunnels in the future, even in Norway.